Welcome to Kauai. This is a beautiful place to start meditation and maybe you'd like to come. I've been meditating for 25 years and what I have found that it helps me with is to stay calm in stressful situations and to just be mindful of your surroundings and aware, which has also helped me in world travel. I travel mainly by myself, so except my angels are always with me, so it's not really by myself. It's developed my intuition and it's made me more relaxed and able to enjoy my own company. So before you start the guided meditation, I wanted to cover a few things with you. Before you start your meditation, it's a great idea to get the yayas out of your body. So that might mean I like to meditate in the morning. That could mean going for a run, doing very simple yoga, or even jumping up and down. So just to get your body moving and to a place where you don't feel like you have to be all fidgety. It's great to start in the morning because it develops a habit for you. And then you start to look forward to it. And even if it's just five minutes at a day, it'll make a difference in your life. One thing I like to do is take deep breaths before I get into it. So this is what I do. Take a deep breath and hold it at the top of your inhale as long as you can with no strain or struggle. And then when you must, exhale slowly and suspend out your breath at the bottom so that you're not taking a breath in again until you must. And you do that three times, holding your breath longer each time. And by the third time, you feel really relaxed. So try it. I'll let you give it a go right now, and then we'll come back. Okay. Another thing to keep in mind, it's better not to eat or drink before because sometimes your stomach can bother you. Uh, certainly don't have any wine or booze. Um, so it's nice to have a cleaned out system before you go into it. Highly recommend establishing a daily practice, even if it's just five minutes, because you'll get into the groove of doing it and it won't seem like a big thing anymore. So, to begin, don't eat or drink, except water. Oh, you can have coffee. Get your yayas out. And think about, once you get into it, think about doing an extended meditation. I've done three 10-day meditations in Thailand, India, and Burma. And they really clean out your pipes. You meditate 14, 12 to 14 hours a day, both sitting and walking. And it really peels the onion layers back to let out things that need to be released. Perhaps anger, perhaps regret and sorrow really works. It worked for me, so I recommend it. And before meditating, another thing to do is just get yourself in a place where you're not going to be disturbed. So it might be before everybody wakes up. Um, do your deep breaths and then have your back straight if you can. Now, don't get caught up in thinking you have to have your legs crossed and sit on the floor and all of that because if it's uncomfortable to begin with, you won't do it. So to begin with, we're going to do a guided meditation in the next video and then we're going to um, talk again after that.